Welcome back guys. I wanna to talk to you how to utilize the elastic on the belt to help with printing on your body when carrying a firearm. So first things first, your holster is going to play a large part in it. You wanna make sure you're getting a quality holster. I use tier one concealment, uh, Axis Elite and MSP if I'm using a light. And I wanna make sure I'm utilizing the belt in the function it was designed for to help conceal that gun. The elastic is going to help bring the gun close to your body so it avoids any layering of your shirt or garment on top of your firearm when you're carrying. The first most common thing I see is people wearing the belt too big. The belt is meant to stretch around your waist. So if you have it exactly where your waist size is, that belt is going to flop around a little bit and you need that extra elastic to keep it tight on your body. So I open up this belt a little bit, this is a little bit bigger than I typically wear it. I'm gonna put my gun in, I wanna show how that gun looks on my person with just a t-shirt on and then we're going to tighten it back down to where i normally carry it and i want you guys to see the difference between the two so let's go ahead and put the belt on we're just going to loop it right through the belt loops so as you can see i didn't have to stretch this belt at all this buckle is resting right on that outside ladder position so as you can see there's actually room in between the belt and my pants right now keeping it at just the exact size of my waist so four and a quarter MNP with an acro, spare mag and a tier one Axis Elite. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. And this, this gun is, I mean, it's, it's on my waist fine. It's pretty snug, but there's still some flop. So if I put my t-shirt down, you can definitely see the acro pointing out. Uh, my stomach's pushing into the gun. Sometimes a wedge might help as well, but there's definitely a printable area on this firearm, especially if I'm walking. Very noticeable. Granted, I also think that printing is mostly a myth. It's just us who are identifying other people with a gun. I think the average NPC out in daily life is not going to notice this lump or anything like that or think anything of it. They're just gonna think your shirt is fitting weirdly. So let's go ahead, let's take the gun off. Let's tighten the belt. And let's see what it looks like after I start utilizing the elastic of the belt to help retain the holster on my body. We're gonna go ahead, we just move the slider closer to the rigid area, making the belt just a little bit smaller by a couple inches. I'm gonna thread this back through. Now you can see that the buckle is farther away and we actually have two ladder notches. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this tighter ladder notch all the way over and you can see how I just stretched that belt and we're getting some folding on my pant lines. We're gonna go ahead and install the holster on the belt. Now you can see that the print of the gun is completely, what am I trying to say? I do it, it's one take or 10 takes. <laughs> so we tightened the belt and now we're utilizing the elastic to help with the concealment of this gun. And you can see the printing is almost non-existent all the way around. You can barely tell that I'm carrying a full-size gun with an extra magazine. Um, with the Rune Tactical Followers, I will have 50 rounds of ammunition between two mags completely concealed with just a t-shirt. So everybody who's living in a hot climate, or if you just like being casual in a t-shirt, this belt is here for you to help with your concealment. If you have this belt adjusted at a looser setting, it's going to simply be resting on your hips rather than hugging your hips. You wanna think of this belt as hugging around your body and keeping that gun close to you. We love our guns, we love shooting, and this belt loves you. It just wants to give you a hug, so let it by tightening it up and utilizing that elastic. Guys, I'm Hunter Constantine, the inventor of this belt, and I hope you found this useful. If you have more questions, drop a comment, contact me through the website. I'm answering all the questions directly myself. You'll have a direct line to me, and I appreciate you guys considering the Hunter Constantine Concealed Carry Belt for your EDC option.